just a few days ago that I met this group for the first time. Um, maybe it's the heat today. Maybe it's the close quarters on the uh, purple bus that you saw outside. But uh, I promise you, already we're all getting on fantastically well. This bus is going off on a tour of Europe. It's going to end up in Turin uh, in July for the week of the City of Science this year. And on the way there and on the way back, it's going to stop in quite a number of other cities and the ambassadors who are on board are going to tell the story of Ireland. In a sense, they're going to bring the, the new spirit of Ireland to our colleagues in Europe. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you as we mark the departure of the Turin bus, a scientific pilgrimage or a journey designed to promote Dublin as capital of science in 2012. Well, 2012 is a once-in-a-generation opportunity for us. It's the Olympics of Science. It's going to happen in Dublin, so we really want to put Dublin on the map. Now, the bus is our first step in that direction. It's a great thing for Dublin to be City of Science in 2012 for a whole host of reasons, but first and foremost, we're going to have between five and 6,000 delegates here spending money, injecting cash into the economy. Internationally, it sends out a clear message that Dublin is a city of innovation, and that should attract companies to locate research and development here in Dublin. At this time, if nothing else, there's a focus on innovation, smart economy. And if you look into that in, in any depth, it's all about science, technology, engineering and mathematics. The bus and the six young ambassadors is a fantastic idea because the young people have such energy and enthusiasm and I think that they're going to portray a very positive image of our city. What I'm really looking forward to is meeting scientists who are really passionate about what they do. I think it's going to be, I suppose, a trail of discovery across Europe. You know, it's going to be very exciting. We've a lot of uh, different stops from, like, you know, Liverpool to Turin. And also then we've got a lot of things to take into it. We've got engineering, Toulouse, and also Barcelona, which was uh, the 2008 city in science. I have to congratulate the ambassadors. They're all young, very bright, intelligent people. They will be outstanding ambassadors for Ireland. I think this is a great opportunity for Brand Ireland to tell the world that we are a key player in technology, we're a key player in science, and it's a global message. Where we can compete is with our intelligence, and we need new ideas, we new, need new interpretations, new processes, new designs, new products, and it's all happening here in Ireland.